What's going on guys, it's your boy Ghost Prodigy, welcome back to another Elden Ring video, and in today's video I will be showing you guys the Bolt of Grand Sax. Now this weapon is mainly a dex weapon, but it has this Ash War where it shoots this ray of a lightning bolt which actually scales with faith. And, well, as you guys can tell, it is freaking nasty, look at how, look at how it just cuts down these bosses, like, this is late game by the way guys, like this is in the snow area. Uh, late game in the hidden uh, snow peaks or mountain tops of wherever the hell this place is, and um, I haven't been using this weapon very much, but my God, it's so good. Like just just the fact that it stuns them, you know, to the ground and all the damage it does, it's it's unbelievable. Like wow, holy holy crap, this weapon is so freaking good. It's a weapon that's more or less more towards the late uh, part of the game and I'm glad it's over there because if this thing was <laughs> at the beginning of the game dude I would you could stomp just destroy every, almost every single boss throughout the game I mean wow this thing is so good it does scale with decks you're gonna need 40 decks to use it and um, obviously faith because it has a lightning shot Alright guys, I cannot recommend this weapon enough. It is just too good, especially if you're going to be doing a dex slash faith build. Uh, and I'm going to break it down on how I do it. So I first cast Golden Bowel, obviously, so to increase the damage. And I drink my Physic uh, uh, Potion, which has the tier that increases lightning damage. Uh, I did pop a Rune Arc here, I, just because I wanted to basically <laughs> overpower myself. But I mean, look at this. Look how much damage it does, even against the avatars. This is not the only or the first avatar I've taken down with just this weapon. I think this is like the second or third one. Because these guys can be annoying to fight, especially these rot ones. Uh, so it's best to keep your distance away from them. And this weapon just works perfectly for these types of uh, encounters where you don't want to get close to the boss and you could just hit them at range. Like, dude, this weapon is just nasty. It's, it's so good. And I mean, I've seen builds. For PvP, keep in mind this is my PvE build, which means this is my build to where I am passing the game, you know, beating the uh, N NPCs and stuff like that. But I've seen builds in PvP where like this thing just wrecks. Like it, 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 if you do a dedicated PvP build around this weapon, I've seen it literally one shot people. Like it's nasty, and I don't know. I just want to show it off, guys. Like hey, you guys want to use this thing, you can pick it up in Lindale, the capital city. Um, like I said, it's a little bit more towards the end game, uh, part of the game, but if you guys do pick it up and you guys are doing a faith slash dex build, like, just, just use this one, but it's, it's so fucking good. It's so good. Alright guys, that's gonna do it for this video. I just wanna do a really quick showcase on this weapon, and if you guys want me to do a dedicated video on how exactly my build works around this, let me know, and I will try and make that happen for you guys. As always, it's been your boy, Shady Ghost, and I'll see you on the next one. Peace.